An IMPD has arrested a 19-year-old for allegedly shooting and killing a bail bondsman who was trying to take him in. It happened at a family funeral, and Emily Longnecker talked with that man's family, still trying to come to terms with what happened. Police say Byron Fearson was just doing his job when he was shot and killed outside this funeral home at 22nd and North Illinois Street. According to investigators, Fearson, a bail bondsman, was trying to take a 19-year-old into custody when that same 19-year-old shot him right on the sidewalk outside Stewart Mortuary. When emergency crews got on scene, they discovered Frierson had died. People were there, witnessed my cousin killed. And he's a big guy. I'm 6'5". And so Byron, he's a, he's, a, he's a pretty big guy. Joseph Arnett says he got a call from his brother telling him what happened to their cousin. He was working, trying to do his job, and ended up getting killed in the process. According to investigators, they caught the suspect, Robert S. Duke, quickly thanks to the help of witnesses. This is a tragedy that my cousin has died, but I'm glad that someone had the positivity and the strength and the courage to say I've seen what happened, and that's, and, that's all, and that's all appreciative. Police believe this was an isolated incident and not a random act. For Arnett, it was an act of brutality, leaving a man just doing his job dead. For someone to take someone's life in the daytime, that tells me that you don't respect not only your life, but you don't respect the people's life around you. Emily Longnecker, Channel 13, Eyewitness News.